What's up YouTube, it's Fitzbro, and we thought Christmas came early with the December patch we got in the last week, but here we have a surfer side patch just released today. It is Thursday, December the 8th, and I know it's gonna include China nerfs and some wall nerfs along with some other adjustments. So stay tuned. Let's see what this latest news is here with this patch. Server side patch 5.1.148.1. Whew. That's a lot. Okay, let's see what they have in store. We're serving up some balance in the server side patch. Ha ha ha, I enjoy it. To help keep the meta fresh, this is huge news, guys. Remember just a year ago, remember a year ago, we were stuck with like Age of Springholds for like months on end. Here we have a week after a new patch and boom, already a new balance. This is amazing. Shout out to the devs doing a great job. You know I call it how I see it. We're making tweaks to some of the top performing sieves in this patch. You'll find that it'll make more time to build walls and defensive structures, a few adjustments to the Chinese and other balance changes to Malians and Mongol civilizations. Okay, read more. Let's see what we can find out here. Okay, balance changes. Stone wall cost has been increased. So this is a nerf for stone walls, has been increased from 50 stone to 20 stone. Stone walls are a very powerful option for shutting down raids. We wanted to their cost to more closely match their effect in the game. So players have been saying for a long time, stone walls are too impactful. Now they're going to be more expensive, so that should help decrease them a little bit, but it still won't stop you from building them if you want to do them. They're just going to cost a little more. Civ specific changes. The Chinese, hope it says nerfed across the board, fix an issue where fortifications were not properly built 50% faster. So I'm, I'm very nervous if that means that they're going to build even faster or the fact that they were building faster than they were intended to. I, I'm not entirely sure what they mean by that line, but I see these bullets after it. So maybe this is exactly what's happening. Stonewall build time increased from eight seconds to 10.5. It only feels like you know, 2.5 seconds, but that times, you know, each villager, how long it takes to build things like that stuff does add up. Palisade walls increase from two to 2.5 keeps build and time increase from one minute 45 to two minutes. That's a huge change for keeps. Outpost build time has been decreased from 45 to 40. So some adjustments across the board with how quickly Chinese will be building fortifications. Is it going to be enough? Not enough too much? I think China can go with a little bit of a nerf. So I'll say this is probably going to be a step in the right position uh, direction. Song Dynasty Villager bonus changed from 35% reduction in time to 33 Okay, the small change, this means villagers will build in 15 seconds instead of 13 seconds. Again, a two second change, not major, but if you add, you know, maybe those two seconds times, you know, 10 extra villagers, whatever it might be, that does add up to a little bit of time. I don't think that's really gonna be like gonna shut them down, but it will certainly make them a little bit weaker and, may and maybe it'll be just right. Maybe it'll be just right. We noticed the town centers were more difficult to build uh, as we made them more difficult to build, it, it basically buffed the Song Dynasty uh, since you didn't have to really... It, it was easier to get the, the, the villager production online. Barbican and villager garrison slots reduced from 10 to 8. So you can't put 10 villagers inside a village or bar Barbican anymore. You can only put 8. So that's going to either force you to build additional towers, whatever it might be. You can't just have 10 villagers on the front line with the Barbican. So that's going to be a little bit of a change of how those uh, buildings play out. They wanted a little bit of a counterplay to the booming of China. So I like this. We got a little bit of a garrison nerf. We've got a, a villager train time nerf. And then we've got how quickly they can build fortifications nerf. So there's a few small nerfs. Maybe they add up to just making it feel right. Let's see what this is. And if you're a China player out there, sound off down in the comments. Let me know. What have they done to your civilization? Is this going to be good? I'm looking forward to it. Malians! We knew that the Malians have been a little strong. I've been playing lots of Malians. Got to conquer. Cattle cost increased from 75 gold to 90 gold. Now, honestly, I didn't even mind when the cattle cost 100 gold. But this is a little bit of a nerf to that. So they'll be a little more expensive. I think it's appropriate. They're really cheap. Uh, so with how quickly they go, a little bit of a nerf there. But, but not, nothing too major. Just a slight tweak. Mongols, pastures, sheep spawn time increased from 120 seconds to 140 seconds. Ooh, a big nerf to the sheep spawn time for the Mongols. Pastures are more cost effective than farms. We wanted to reduce the delta in power level between these options. Okay, what's on the horizon? As we prepare to head in the winter holiday, lots of plans up their sleeves. 
You can read about some of what's in the roadmap. We've seen that before. And we'll have more news to share with you about the next public update preview in January. So a new pup will be coming soon. We're going to know about it in January. It won't be pup focused. We also have a new season three event kicking off. They're going to be working on making the hardest AI more difficult to play against. So they're going to be making the hardest AI harder. It'll be fun. That's good to hear. Uh, you'll see those adjustments in next minor patch early next year. We hope you're ready for a challenge. Our balance team is already breaking a sweat, testing some early concepts of the hardest AI. I bet the devs are out there getting destroyed by the current hardest AI. Nah, I'm sure they're all Conqueror 3. Some of this might change the disclaimer. Okay, guys. So there you have it. Malians, they've got a little bit of a cow nerf pizza. Thank you. Say hello to YouTube. This is going on YouTube. We got YouTube. pizza. Fitzwife has Costco's provided greatest. Costco pizza. Hey, they didn't sponsor the stream, but if you know a frozen pizza. But we're going to close off uh, this little extra balance patch video for you. So let me know. We got China nerfs, Malian slightly nerfed, and a Mongol slightly nerfed, and a change to walls. Should be fun. I'm going to be live over twitch.tv slash Fitzbro. Come on over. Say hello. And I'll see you there.